Hi, I'm Maria Angela D'Acunto and welcome back to Earth from Space. This week, Copernicus Sentinel-2 takes us over the Gulf of Kutch, along the west coast of India. The Gulf of Kutch divides the Kutch and the Katiavar Peninsula regions in the state of Gujarat. Reaching eastward for around 150 kilometers, the Gulf varies in width from approximately 15 to 65 kilometers. The area is renowned for extreme daily tides, which often cover the lower-lying areas, comprising networks of creeks, wetlands and alluvial tidal flats in the interior region. Gujarat is the largest salt-producing state in India. Some of the white rectangles dotted around the image are salt evaporation ponds, which are often found in major salt-producing areas. The arid climate in the region favours the evaporation of water from the salt ponds. Just north of the area pictured here lies the Great Run of Kutch, a seasonal salt marsh located in the Thar Desert. The run is considered the largest salt desert in the world. The Gulf of Kutch has several ports, including Oka, at the entrance of the Gulf, and Kandla, visible on the northern peninsula. Kandla is one of the largest ports in India by volume of cargo handled. The Gulf is rich in marine biodiversity. Part of the southern coast was declared India's first marine sanctuary and marine national park in 1980 and 82, respectively. There are hundreds of species of coral in the park, as well as algae, sponges and mangroves. Copernicus Sentinel-2 is a two-satellite mission. Each satellite carries a high-resolution camera that images Earth's surface in 13 spectral bands. The mission's frequent revisits over the same area and high spatial resolution allow changes in water bodies to be closely monitored. And that's all for today. From the ESA Web TV Studios, I'm Mariangela D'Acunto. Thanks for watching and see you next time.